But Never Trees was written by Lord XV Envy. You can find it on the SCP Wiki under a Creative Commons share alike attribution license. It is in reference to SCP 6707, in which trees are found to be anomalous because they exist nowhere else in the entirety of the known universe except Earth. Across the sea of endless stars, Foundation probes go ever far, past alien suns and alien seas, past alien bears and alien bees, but never trees. On every world that teems with blue, where plants are plenty or even few, they land their craft and journey thus through canyons, plains, and lush, but never trees. On the thirteenth world of Zeta-9 are flowers, bushes, even vines, grasses, mosses, algae too, that color water, green and blue, but never trees. And on the crags of Kron Bulkai, rocky pillars stab the sky. They drink in sun and breathe out gas, yet lacking leaves to let air pass. They are not trees. Says 054 to 053, in all the stars, how could this be? There's lions, cattle, even geese, cotton, blacks, even fleece. But not one tree. They argue, riding through the years, as data flows like distant tears from worlds that dance and spark with life, worlds at peace and worlds of strife, but not of trees. Mankind leaps from dying earth beyond the cradle of its birth. Diaspora long meant to be, stellar manifest destiny. But not for trees. Now humankind rules the stars, from ancient earth to black holes far. On every world that's home to man, they brought from earth the life they can. But never trees. Thank you very much for listening. If you enjoyed the video, hit the subscribe button and then hit the notification bell next to that so you're notified when I upload new videos. And then head on over to patreon.com forward slash D Sumerian and pledge at any level like everybody here on the screen already has, including MC Cashmill, who's pledged at $50, and Sinjariki, who's pledged at $100. It's nice to know that I'm not alone out here. And I will see you all again on Tuesday.